What's going on everyone, Metal Raymond here, and welcome back to Group Iron Man episode number 12 for you all. Today, we have a lot of more great stuff in store for you. I don't want to spoil too much, but let's just say we got a very special helmet. If I didn't spoil it in the title and thumbnail already. Probably did, didn't I? I'm not sure yet. You'll find out soon. We did a lot in this episode, and I really hope you guys will enjoy it. But first, of course, we have a juicy, juicy giveaway. Before I get into what I'm giving away and how you enter the giveaway, I do want to let you guys know that a new giveaway winners will be revealed early in the next week. So stay tuned for that and we'll be covering a bunch of videos once again. I believe we'll cover around, well, six videos or so, I think. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, we have two $30 bonds for this particular video. Two different winners, each gets one $30 bond. If you want to enter the giveaway, all you need to do is, of course, subscribe to the channel, like this video, comment your ring name, name down below, and turn on the post notifications. You've done all that, you enter the giveaway. I wish you all the best of luck on that. If you're new to Runex or you want to try out Runex for yourself, please do use the link at the top of the description. Helps me out a ton as it's a referral link. And of course, make sure you join the Runex Discord and my private Discord, the Metal Squad, with the links at the bottom of the description. Very useful if you want to stay up to date with new when I go live with uh, fucking new video uploads and all of that good stuff. And the Runex Discord, obviously, whenever an update comes out, if they have polls and all of that good shit. Anyway, intro is getting long, so I hope you guys enjoy this episode. And we just leveled 97 Slayer. Two more levels to go and we'll finally have our precious 99. That's pretty dope. Gonna be one of my first real 99s, like grindy types. Um, other than that, already at 179 Slayer points back again. It's going so incredibly quick due to the Barbarian Slayer. So yeah, just have to grind it out for a little bit longer and we'll have it, man. And once we uh, do get our few Slayer Helm, I think I'll start doing some boss Slayer tasks. Hopefully I'll get tasks that I can easily do, but you know, we'll have to wait and see what kind of tasks we get, but it will motivate me to do more different things like Alchemical oh, Hydra, Zura, Cerberus, Thermal Nucleus, Smoke Dabble, all kinds of tasks that are available. I think it gives even more points, but of course the tasks itself are a lot slower due to uh, the fact that you have to kill a boss. But we'll have to wait and see how that goes. Um, yeah, just a bit more of grinding and then uh, we'll finally get it. Right, another task completed. Unfortunately, my dumbass is completely out of cannonballs. So I have to make some more. 390 Slayer points already though. It's going strong, but I need to make some. Oh, by the way, while we're at it, I have plenty of Runex points at this point, and this will help with getting a 99 Herblore over time, get a Herbicide again. We already f failed the first one, it's a 50% chance, so that obviously means that we're gonna get it on the second try, right? That's how it works. There we go. Uh, Mazaka. Nani? Okay, let's try again. I don't want to buy multiple because they're really fucking expensive. 50k Runex points. You ain't gonna tell me I failed three in a row, right? Huh. Game. Thank you! Fuck! Alright, there we go. Get that mold. I don't really need the ores, bro, but thank you nonetheless. Finally got the herbicide, that's gonna help. I should have done that earlier, but there's still gonna be plenty of Slayer nonetheless. V. Andre is uh, dropping the tips to my dumbass that doesn't know enough about the game. I think you can get, he said you can get the skilling backpack from the room coin machine. There's another little fold. Let's have a looky looky. Uh, I mean, open the shop. Nope. Shop. There we go. Skilling backpack. 375. Huh. Well, I'll be fucked. I didn't realize that. Should have bought it long ago. That helped, could have helped me so much with skilling. Also, bank boosts. Uh, those are a bit more expensive, not gonna lie. Don't need those. Care about those. There is one other thing I really want, which it. Wait, what is this? Currency pouch. Pouch. Ah, yeah, it's useless. But um, I do want to. Ooh. Okay, okay, I'm getting distracted too much. I want to get the uh, efficiency blessing. I think that's a really good one. It's only 5k rune coins. But uh, yeah, at least we got the skilling backpack. Should have gotten that a while ago. Huh. That's pretty dope. The fact that it starts at 12. Ring of Greed gives 7.5% rune coin exchange bonus, provides a 5% chance to get double drops while equipped. That is actually really good. I kind of want to get that. Oh, you can just get these accessories from here? I didn't know that. Oh, I want to start saving up for those, because bonus treasure and sacred, so a combined 
22.5k runic, point, uh, runic coins, which is kind of expensive. 44 tune accessory with an, uh, another 10k. Combined effects of the sacred bonus and treasure accessories, really nice. And then on top of that you can master it for an extra... Donate mystery boxes, prize keys, two sacred tokens and point chests. I want to save up for that, not gonna lie. But that would be really dope. But yeah, we got the skilling backpack for now. Alright, got myself a juicy 1800 cannonballs, not bad at all. Let's continue that Slayer grind. Iron Dragons, beautiful. No, actually it's kinda shit, but whatever. Another task completed and it gave me a Brimstone key, which is my 10th one. And like promised, we're gonna open them every 10, so let's see if we get lucky this 10. Give me the Hammer of God. Please, uh, Dragon Hasta, Sharks, Eddie Orr, Manta Rays, Renewals, Mystic Gloves, Diamonds, Dragon Knives, Last Fucking One, Wow, awesome, thank you game, I appreciate that, at least those items are good one points I guess. It is time to be interrupted during my precious task to kill another emo, let's go. Do, 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 do. Good luck boys, let's get it, epic pet box for metal, for me, no, rip, alright let's see the exchange, come on give me the good shit. Ooh, that's a whole lot of keys. One bags of riches, blood money, and shitty tokens, okay. Cool. Oh my, I just hit 98 Slayer, unexpected. I was just teleporting away. It was on my last kill, beautiful. One more level, till the max. And an E-Corp is about to spawn, which doesn't happen too often, so let's go ahead and get ready for that. I'm trying to see what kind of setup I have that I can use at E-Corp. Do I even want to use melee there? Yeah, probably. Well, this is a huge mess, as always, but as long as I don't get hit, I'm all good. Gotta make sure I move every once in a while. Just make sure I don't get hit. I don't want to lose my run energy, because that's a pain in the ass in here. So, oh, we have the Wraith spawns. Let me just get an E-Core pet. That would be amazing. Well, if I can keep this up, it's gonna be a zero damage kill. That's pretty amazing. Didn't get hit a single time yet. All these plebs getting guarded. Like, what are you doing? You're sleeping on these tactics. <gasps> so many drops and nothing in my name. Fuck. What did I get? Point mystery chest and a shard. Okay, I'll have to live with it. Not even fucking slayer points. Yikes. <laughs> Group armor got a divine dude. Fuck. Gimp. That dude's luck. And an iron fox with an epic pet box. Damn, dude, the dream. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and open this price chest. Garbage. A little doo doo doo. <sighs> it does kinda hurt to see so many drops and none in my name. E Corp is a pain, man. I really don't know why it's not allowed to use epic luck tokens. Like, I get it, he has some good drops, but it spawns like three times a fucking week. You know what I mean? Like, you barely ever see one. So you might as well, you know, get the triple drop. Most 9 out of 10 times, you're just gonna get three shards instead of one. Like, ooh. But imagine if we get 500 of them at this rate. Fuck! Another task has been completed. Only a little bit over 100 points left to go. We're getting close, boys. Oh, so close. Alright, Dust Devil task completed. Hey, it actually gave me enough. That's weird. No, it is. It is 15. Oops. Alright, cool. <laughs> 1009 Slayer points, which means I have finally unlocked my few Slayer Helms. So let's go ahead and grab that bad boy. We need all our Slayer Helms. I just asked in the chat, like, hey, is Dust Devils 10 Slayer points or 15 for a task? It's 10, it's 10, it's 10, it's 10. Completes task. Oh, it's 15. Okay, cool. Anyway, otherwise I wouldn't have had enough points if it was a 10 task. It would have given me 25 points and I would have been a little bit off. But hey, here we fucking go, boys. Few Slayer Helm unlocked. Absolutely beautiful. Can't believe it. We did it this quickly. Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. I'm just a random voiceover guy. But let's just take a moment and appreciate what Metal Raymond has done, what he has achieved today. The Fused Slayer Helmet was way beyond his reach a couple of episodes ago, but now 
after my boy has finally managed to get his hands on the Slayer Helmet, the fused Slayer Helmet, there's only one thing left to do, and that is obtaining the Twisted Bow, which he is probably never going to fucking get. May I remind you, this RNG is so fucking ridiculous on this guy, let's just hope for the best. Now, we have to move on. At least fast for my standards, <laughs> so to say. For those of you that don't know what this actually does, in, a, in case any one of you are new, it's 20% damage against Slayer Task and 5% damage against all monsters, which is even off tasks. And it combines all the stats of all the Slayer Helms uh, into one. So you'll have all the Gucci stats in comparison, like this one is 7 Prayer and 3 in everything, so this one gets the 7 prayer, this one has high magic, so this one gets the high magic, basically all stats combined making it really strong, and then on top of that 20% damage just like the other helms, but with an additional 5% damage if you are off task, and that's what I've been waiting for, I've been waiting for this bad boy, oh man, so glad I got it out of the way. Right, so now we're gonna get a new task, and for the first time ever on this account I'm gonna try to get a boss slayer task, let's see what we get. 20 Barrels Brothers, absolutely amazing, let's go ahead and get ready to do that. I have 6 keys left over and since I won't be doing Brimstone tasks for a while anyway, I might as well open them. Just give me the fucking hammer, man. Don't be a dick. Don't be a dick. You dick! The first run. Nothing. Eh. Run number 2. <gasps> oh, that is really good. Thank you, game. Oh, wait, I can make it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's fucking go. I can use that. No way. Let's fucking go, boys. Third one, come on. You know what I want to see. Crest bear piece, crest bear piece. Please, not the helmet. Boom. Oh, God, I threw up a little in my mouth. That's fucking disgusting. Sack of tokens, though. Ugh. Bad ones. Bags of riches. Uh, point box. Uh. Oh man, so much trash. Next run, end the daily. F fuck. I somehow thought I got an arms rope from that dude to where it was in my inventory. Darrox played legs. Okay, we we'll still need to do one more run because I need my task done. So this is gonna be the last skill of my Slayer task. I think this should give me 50 Slayer points since it's Barbarian. That's actually pretty insane, not gonna lie. I'm not gonna rush for 5,000 points at the moment just to get the instant uh, current. Oh, the, wow, okay. <clears throat> at least it's not the Elden Mall. Um, but yeah, I'll slowly but surely get it over time with uh, 50 points per task at this rate. Like, boom. 30 plus 20, yeah, that's amazing. That's gonna be really quick. Let's see what we get. We're gonna finish the run because it's only one more kill anyway. Let's see what we get. Good luck. Nothing. Well, tooth half, but basically nothing. Let's see a Zulra task. A chemical Hydra, interesting. First task. Oh, we're definitely gonna do this on the Hydra task. 66 of them. Well, let's hope I can land a drop. Well, this is uh, some irony. I'm at 59 Slayer points because I just bought that fuse, right? Yeah, I don't have Boots of Stone yet. So I'm gonna have to get one of my teammates to sacrifice 100 points right there to buy them for me. Thanks to my boy QWERTY. Awesome. Now let's knock out some Hydras. We're gonna use Epic Luck Tokens for all 66 skills. Let's pray to the Lord Heavens above that we get a Hydra's Claw. Cause that's gonna be fucking amazing if I do, right? I'm gonna be making some money moves because I want my Ring of Greed. So what I'm gonna buy is this bad boy Glorious Gem for half my donator tickets. Cause really useless, so I'm gonna ignore that. And see how many rune points I'll get for sacrificing all my leftover shit. The Arkham Boots alone will give 3.5k, which is amazing in and of its own. Let's see what everything together will give us. 250 per pet. Oh, I can't do Berserk Necklace yet. What about this? And this? And this? Nope, not this. This. Yes, yes. Nope, can't do that one. Hasn't been 24 hours yet, that kind of sucks. Although my daily has reset. Fuck the chaotic mode, don't need that. Can't do those. Can't do those. It gives us a total of 5k, at least enough for the daily. But it is a bit of a shame to... I also don't want to waste it. I don't want to wait for it. We can get more over time anyway. If 
But I don't see myself getting over 5k without the input. So this will give us 8.2k. If I wait a little bit... It, it's quite a long wait, honestly. I'll have to wait like another 4 hours. And I want to get the ring of... Uh, whatever the fuck it's called. Hmm. I'm trying to see... If I can just sacrifice enough to get... The ring first and then save the gem for like a bigger one. Alright, I've made my decision. Hopefully this will be enough. Everything together. Because I'm not going to be doing like the biggest ticket items. Yes. No, I'm 200 short still. Okay, even with that, I'm a little bit short. Yeah, this should do it. Then we can buy the Ring of Greed first, which also increases your rune coin wield. Yeah, these are, these are the smart ones. Few rune coin shop, Ring of Greed. Oh, it's actually way cheaper. It's 7.5k when you're not an Iron Man. Easy game. So I even have to spare. So now if I were to, you know, do it again, <clears throat> do it again and put in the boots. Gives a little bit extra because of the ring. And then this on top heavily increases it. But I'm going to save that for like a big boy move. 